Hi, this is Yvonne, and I'm here with Eddie Perez from Hi. La Villa Rica, and uh, formerly La Bamba. So you know Eddie. Okay, and La Bamba. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Eddie is, um, like I said, from La Villa Rica here in Lebanon, Marion County, and we're celebrating Cinco de Mayo. Exactly. This I would call it Drinco de Mayo. Drinco de Mayo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's coming up Saturday. Saturday. And, of course, we're going to have the Derby, too. So mm -hmm. I would say it's going to be Derby and Cinco de Mayo. So both at the same time. Okay, we're going to celebrate. We're going to celebrate whoever wins. We're going to celebrate anyway. Or whoever loses, right? <laughs> whoever we, loses. We don't we're gonna, care. We're going to celebrate with <laughs> special margaritas. Okay. Yeah. All right. And you're going you're gonna to make a special margarita for us today, yes. right? Yes. Now tell me why this one is special. Because that one, they don't use tequila. Oh. They use mezcal. I don't know if you're familiar with the mezcal, with the little worm they got in it. Oh, <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> the one, the worm is the one that gets you drunk. So. Okay. Okay. Well, our taste tester won't mind. <laughs> she, she won't care. Okay. Tell us. Uh, give us the uh, ingredients that are going to okay. go into this um, margarita. Of course, we got uh, mezcal. Mm -hmm. We got the triple set. Okay. We got the that one is another kind of recipe mm. for the special drink. Okay. Uh, curacao. Okay. And Agave nectar. Okay. That's a special for okay. uh, mezcal margarita. Agave. Yeah. Okay. And fresh orange. Uh -huh. Fresh lime juice. All right. Ice. And the glasses. For that. Okay. So that's all you need, huh? That's all you need. All right. All right. Put us one together. All right. Let's start with the lime juice. Okay. I mean, I'm sorry, orange juice. Okay. And this is really going to be fresh. It's, it's fresh, fresh taste okay. from La Villa Rica. Okay, and that's like a half an <laughs> It's a whole orange juice. I get you orange juice all over Very you. tasty orange juice. Yes, yeah, so fresh orange juice. Very fresh. You use one whole orange. Whole orange. And hopefully you have a squeezer like this at home. Yes. To get all that. You got right. juice out of there. Oh, okay. You're gonna put a full, full um, lime juice. Okay. Wow. This is very fresh. Okay. And um, I'm gonna say the oranges and the limes. You can get these at your local stores here in town. So, and then you're just gonna hand squeeze that. Yeah, I think it's much better with it. Hand. Yeah, put, they give put, it. Put, yeah, put that little, put the love in it, right? The <laughs> love comes when you put, use your hands. Okay. So we have one orange and we have one lime. One lime, lime a whole lime. One whole lime. Okay. okay. You need about a half an ounce of agave nectar. Okay. Agave nectar. It's sweet. Uh-huh. Just pour it. So that's going to make it sweet. Okay. Okay. You need, you can do either tequila or, or mezcal. Okay. But I'd rather use mezcal because they give a different flavor to the margaritas. Okay, and this, the mezcal is where the worm is, right? With the worm. Okay, we want to make sure we get the worm today. You're going to put about a two ounce and a half. Okay. Okay, and we're making a mezcal margarita. Something mezcal. that's, this one is a little different from your usual. Yes, it's because the mezcal, they got different flavor mm -hmm. from the tequila. Okay. So, okay. and you're gonna put a, uh, like a little dash of the uh, curacao. Curacao, okay. Smell like orange too. Yes, it does. Yeah, mm -hmm. smell like orange. So just a little bit. Okay. And you're gonna use triple set, triple just a set. little bit too. Okay. Small dash. <laughs> it's refreshing, margarita. Yes, it's gonna be a really refreshing for margarita. A nice weather like today. Uh huh. Hopefully, don't change tomorrow. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> and you're gonna pour ice, a little bit. Uh -huh. And you're gonna shake it. Shaken, not stirred. <laughs> so, you need it. 
Okay, I'm putting lime juice all around the rim of the glass. And salt. And turn it over into the salt. Ice. Let me move this knife. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can check it. Okay. You gotta check it twice. And there's a different color because the okay. orange. Okay. We're gonna have our taste tester come on uh -huh. over here on the other side. Let me cut mm -hmm. another. Limes mm -hmm. and lemon in mm -hmm. uh, orange. Okay. Okay, we're gonna make this pretty. So you just drop it right there. Okay, now we're cutting the lime. We've got an extra piece of orange. And we'll yeah, I'm going to get another piece of orange in a minute. Okay, put that on the rim of the glass. Oh, that looks marvelous. Mm -hmm. And trust me, it, it tastes <laughs> nice. Trust me, it's good. <laughs> okay. Got a lot of fresh fruit on this. Yes. So, so it's healthy. <laughs> <laughs> After quite a few, I don't know if it's going to be healthy or not. So, there you have it. There you have it. Mezcal margarita. Yeah. Let, let me show it to everybody, first of all. Mezcal margarita. Okay. And I'm going to hand this over to, to our, taste. Taste, our taste tester here, Ms. Okay. Karen King. The, the okay. thing is, they got the lime juice, the fresh lime juice, orange juice. They give you different flavor uh -huh. than regular. Okay. I hope you like it. <laughs> Oh, yes. Mm. That's the best I've ever had. <laughs> you yeah, don't have that really puckery that you would get just well, the, the, lemon, the, the other ones have, um, like, a, uh, what is it? Like a mix. S mix, yeah. yeah. No, yeah. This, that's really, really that good. That one is, is fresh. It's, it's orange, fresh. It's the orange flavor and the fresh juice, the well, fresh lime. Mm -hmm. That one gives a better taste, too. The, the agave. The agave nectar. Agave nectar. Again, what, what is that made from? For the agave from the tequila. Oh, for, okay. Yeah. That's the plant that the you made the tequila from. Mm -hmm. Is this a regular orange? Yes. Gosh, it looks like a grapefruit orange. It's it delicious. looks like a grapefruit yeah. orange. Yeah. Yeah. Delicious. You want to give us that recipe again so that our viewers can maybe put one of those together? Yes. It's a, it's agave nectar, okay. tequila, oh, mezcal. Mm -hmm. um, triple set, orange curacao, salt, fresh lime juice, and fresh orange juice. Okay, so. and you can find these at La Villa Rica this weekend? This Cinco, weekend. Cinco de Mayo? Cinco de Mayo. Okay, now if I come in Friday night and it's not Cinco de Mayo yet, can I still get one? Oh yeah, these? yeah, we okay. serve that one. Okay. But we're gonna have that one on a special. Do they do this all, um, in the, on the rocks only, or is it, they do it both ways? It tastes much better on the rocks. I was gonna say, yeah. it, has, it, yeah. it needs to be this Yeah, way. because the, um, the other one on the frozen, uh, that looks, they lost the flavor. Yeah, yeah. yeah awesome. the freshness. Okay. And that's, Delicious. And that's good for weather like this. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, we're, we've started off celebrating Cinco de Mayo already. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's still April, but we're celebrating. And we want all of you to come out and see, uh, see, uh, come out to see Eddie at La Villa Rica this weekend. We're going to have a bunch of specials on the Cinco de Mayo. Okay. Mm -hmm. T-shirt for the customers. Nice. Lot of, Good celebration. Yeah. It'll be fun. Yeah, yeah it'll be a lot it's of fun. Be a yeah. lot of fun. All right. So come and join La Villa Rica. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> this has been Yvonne McNary for Central Kentucky Television.